Long-haired dog breeds come in all shapes and sizes and make excellent companion, working, or show dogs. Although they are recognized in dog shows and on the street for their long, silky coats, in this video, we have listed 10 long-haired dog breeds that anyone would envy. Number 10, Shih Tzu. Recognized by their flowing, dense coat, Shih Tzus are known for being happy and outgoing small dogs. Their coats require weekly grooming and brushing several times a week. Ideal for apartment living or elderly companions, they require minimal exercise. Good with older children, Shih Tzus should be watched around smaller children as they can be unsettled with rough or awkward handling. Number nine, Lhasa Apso. A companion dog known for its long, dense coat, Lhasa Apsos are known for being sturdy little dogs that are extremely devoted to their families. Their coats require daily brushing to be kept tangle and mat free and can be clipped shorter to be more manageable. Although they're small, Lhasa Apsos are also independent and stubborn by nature and require a firm hand when training. Number eight, Bernese Mountain Dog. One of four varieties of Swiss Mountain Dog, the Bernese Mountain Dog is the only one with a long, silky coat. The breed is known as a working dog valued for its intelligence, strength, and agility. Its uses today include agility and obedience training, herding, tracking, and therapy work. Because of their double coats, Bernese require regular brushing, but their gentle, easygoing manner makes them a good choice for families. Number seven, Commodore. Don't be fooled by the giant mop appearance. The Commodore is used today as a sheep guardian and is known for being a large, dignified dog. Its long, white-corded coat helps protect the dog from the elements and from injury by predators. Their coats require detailed attention, including separating the cords by hand to prevent matting or tangling. After bathing, Commodores should be dried with a towel as much as possible, as it can take two or three days for their coats to dry. Number six, Havanese. A member of the toy group, the Havanese is native to Cuba and likely arrived in the U.S. via trading ships. Their coats are known for being long and heavy and can be wavy, curly, or straight in any color combination. They require only moderate exercise and are happy to be the center of attention in the home. Havanese are also known for their easygoing attitude and will require frequent brushing and grooming. Keeping their coat shorter can minimize grooming time. Number five. Afghan Hound. With a dignified presence and a history as an aristocratic dog, the Afghan Hound is covered with thick, very fine hair. Their coat is one found among animals native to high altitudes and can come in all colors. While the breed is known as an excellent hound, its popularity as an exceptional show dog has risen with its introduction to the U.S. Afghan Hounds do well as companion dogs, but need regular exercise because of their size, in addition to regular grooming because of their long coat. Number four, Yorkshire Terrier. Yorkies may be official members of the toy group, but they're naturally brave, determined, and energetic, and have the demeanor of a dog with a larger stature. The breed was known as a companion animal of high society European families, and was prized for its long, silky blue and tan coat. Yorkies are bold, curious, and always ready for adventure. Number three, Maltese. Recognized because of its long, silky white hair, the Maltese is a quintessential lap dog known for being lively, playful, and fearless in spite of its toy size. The breed originated in Malta and has been owned royally across the globe for centuries. Largely indoor dogs, Maltese do not need outdoor exercise beyond short walks and socialization. Its coat, which can be floor length, may be clipped for easier maintenance and must be combed regularly. Number two, Bearded Collie. Known for herding sheep and differentiated from the Highland Collie because of its long facial hair, the Bearded Collie has been bred for centuries to be a companion and servant of man. They are obedient and popular companion dogs that love to play with children and spend time with people. They're known for their double coats, which are soft and furry underneath, with a straight, coarse outer coat that requires regular brushing to be kept matte and tangle-free. Number one, soft-coated Wheaton Terrier. 
The soft-coated wheat interior has been known in Ireland for more than 200 years as an all-purpose farm dog, prized for being agile, quick, and able to patrol borders of small farms. He shares common ancestry with the Kerry Blue and Irish Terrier, but is distinguished by its soft, silky long coat. This long-haired breed requires brushing every other day, and because it does not shed, Wheatons require trimming and bathing on alternating months to maintain the shape and look of its coat. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. Which is your favorite long-haired dog breed? Let us know in the comments. Here are some other cool videos I know you'll enjoy. See you guys later.